All right, we're back. We're back, we're back, we're back. Today we're gonna talk about as removed, serviceable, repair, and overhaul, and, and the difference between those conditions. In a previous post, we talked about the difference between new surplus, new, and factory new, and there's a lot of confusions that, that go into those conditions, and, and you, can, you can see I, the, the lights behind me agree as they, they explode. No, they're not exploding, I'm just kidding. But as removed, so what is as removed? As removed is, is right off the aircraft, and it, it can be in, in many different forms. Typically, when a component is, is pulled from, a, from an airline's aircraft, it'll come with a, a reason for removal, or maybe the, the reason of a failure. And it, it'll come with a documentation stating that. But when, when a unit comes out of a part out, it'll just have a, a, a removal tag and it won't state the reason for removal because it, it, it was a part out. So that condition is as removed and it could even be BER. We won't know that until it goes to a, an MRO for repair and overall and even a, a functional test. So serviceable is a, a little bit different. Serviceable, it's a component that's an as removed component that goes onto a, a bench for functional tests. Now the functional test is, is just states that it's in working condition and it's then tagged with an airworthiness cert. Now the airworthiness cert can be the FAA 8130, um, EASA, it can be uh, CAAC, it can be a number of different airworthiness uh, certifications depending on your location or your, your requirements uh, for that matter. So if a serviceable is really the, the next best thing uh, as removed. Some components uh, can be tagged serviceable, some fail on, on, on the bench and will need to be repaired. But serviceable is, is I don't want to say the worst condition because it's not necessarily the worst condition, but it's, it's, uh, it's the first tier condition and uh, not a lot of work goes into it, um, if, if that makes more sense. Now repair. A lot of confusion goes into uh, you know, serviceable and repair or even repairable. Repairable is a different classification. Repairable means it can be repaired, functional tested, or overhauled. And that classification classification goes back to it being as removed. So the component is repairable. Now repaired means it's a unit that needed a little bit more work. So you have the functional test that passes, that goes onto the, the bench and it goes into functional test. This unit will need to be repaired. So, you know, it needs uh, extra gaskets, it needs extra certain extra piece parts, but it won't go into a full overhaul. So it won't be required to have the 100% overhaul kit according to the CMM. So cosmetically, it, it's a little bit better, a little bit more work goes into it, a little bit more elbow grease uh, goes into it. So that's repaired. So uh, um, th that's one step up above uh, the serviceable condition or functional test condition, wh whatever people want to classify it as. Now overhaul, this is the best condition, um, just as short of new. And sometimes I, I even prefer overhaul condition uh, over new surplus, obviously, to depending on the component. And this is a, a lot of confusion on the military side that we see, but not on the commercial side. So overhaul requires a 100% overhaul kit. According to the CMM, um, it, it requires a lot, of, lot more time, a lot more t material. And even uh, in addition to the 100% kit, overhaul kit, it might require additional piece parts. So hopefully after this video, there's no more confusion on what as removed, serviceable, repaired, and uh, overhaul conditions are. And, and make sure you check out our, our post about new surplus, new and factory new, because that has got a lot of attention and that really uh, cleared up a lot of confusion on, on those classifications as well. I added a, uh, we added a link below to, to both to both articles so make sure you check them out and if you have any questions just shoot me an email if you know my email just shoot me an email um uh, with any questions or you can find me on linkedin and, and twitter and you can just go to our twitter handle at skylink intl and ask your questions there if you want so now that you know those classifications we are out